I created this video to give you a quick look at the features of Schoology discussions that will help you quickly read, respond, and grade student work. Notice first of all the comment timeline. This appears in the lower right area of the teacher view and you can uh, scroll backwards and forwards through the comment timeline using these arrows. Now this can be helpful when I um, have done some reading of posts previously and I come back to do some more work and I see that the last time I checked I had read through posts through about 118 and I can see now that there are 133 posts. So I can quickly scroll over to the last one I read verify that and then go on and then I can um, quickly find where I need to read um, and begin um, commenting or replying to students. As you scroll up and down along the right side of the comments here you'll see either a check mark or this symbol here. So that symbol means that I need to grade that student's work. So let's pick one of these here and when I click on that Notice that it says here that I'm setting an overall discussion grade for this student. So not for this individual one re response, but for all of the work done on this discussion. You can place the grade here, and then you can add a comment here. And then check the box if you want to show that comment to the student. And then click Submit. This submits it um, to the student and also to my gradebook. There might be um, occasions where you want to write a comment just as a reminder to yourself, but you don't want that um, comment shown to the student, so just don't click that checkbox right there. Another feature that makes it easy for you to quickly look at all the student work individually is this filter by user. So if I go in here, I can click on a student name, and then as I scroll down, that student's responses are all highlighted. So I can quickly um, see the entirety of that student's posts. And while I can give comments to an individual reply, remember the grade is for the, um, all of the comments altogether. So there you go. Those features make it quick and easy to read, respond, and grade discussion posts. In, in addition, you can create ungraded online discussions as well.